Hello, nerd fam, and welcome back to the fabulous Palo Alto Studios here at the Cube. My name is Savannah Peterson. Thrilled to be bringing you a preview of Workato Wow today. And joining me is no other than Chandar. Thank you so much for coming to take the time today. It's great to be here, Savannah. What a great setup, and it's excited to be here today. I know, I've been so excited working with your team. They're all fabulous humans. Great brand colors you've got going on. You're taking us to the Cosmo. It's going to be super posh. You mentioned that there are three fantastic reasons to go to WOW this year. Why don't you break those down for me? What's number one? Yeah, no, before I get to the reason, first of all, we're going to have hundreds of folks from our customers and our partners and prospects coming there, including us, right? And so from all over the world, All right? over the world, all over That's the world. Amazing. It's great. And so the three reasons, number one, AI, right? And, there's, and really the goal is, like, how do we help our customers transform from AI at the edge to the core of their business? Now, there's a lot of noise going on on AI. But we kind of taken a different approach and really kind of bring AI to life, make it actionable AI rather than experimental AI. And we're going to showcase, we showcase more than 100 customers today are using 20 agents, you know, enterprise agents across the front office and back office today, and how they're bringing this to life and making this actionable for the core business processes. And yeah. we're going to share that. And these aren't just MVPs you're talking about. These are real applications at scale, correct? These are real agents at scale from the front office, from sales, in marketing, customer support, to back office, finance, IT, HR, et cetera, across the spectrum, and bring this to life. Just not talking about it at the edge, but yeah. making it at the core of their business. Yeah, absolutely. I think that's such an important conversation. What I'm hearing from you is you're going to make it real and dispel some of the hype and show us the practical applications. Okay. Yeah, this sounds... is a show, not tell conference. Ugh, music to my ears. I wish every technology company was uh, was subscribing to that mantra right now. It would make our jobs a lot more entertaining. All right, so that was reason number one. I'm already convinced, but tell me reason number two. No, it's interesting. Extending on that, you know, we're going to launch probably the biggest product that we built to, built to date. It's a new place, it's a new way that work gets done, and it's called Workado Go. And think of it as a command center. It's, it's like a command center, a cockpit for employees where agents, enterprise search, and everything that we do come together for an employee to get work done. So rather than going into all these disparate places, it's a single plane of glass that they go into and have that interaction for them to get their work done where the agents are doing the work for them to bring the best version of themselves. We're going to be launching Workado Go, and it's going to be available for our customers for free at the event who come there. Oh, that's very exciting. That's another great reason to attend. All right, and give me lucky number three. Lucky number three is the foundation of the company for the last 10 years. Is really all these agents and these things I've talked about is built on a foundation of our enterprise integration and orchestration capability. And that's NS Gartner recently rated us number one in terms of completeness of vision and for AI and that capability. So we're going to be releasing, talking about the 500 new features that we built in the last one year for that and helping companies modernize their stack when it comes to their integrations, when it comes to all areas of what we call orchestration, right? From RPA to business process management to what we call IDP, data integration to API management, all areas, and really help companies modernize their stacks when it comes to this, as well as showcase how that layer is so important for them to make their AI journeys real in their enterprises. So yeah. all these things, bringing AI to life and having the foundation that gives them all the context and skills to do that. Yes, and it sounds like people are going to actually be able to come here and take actionable learnings away that they can apply. This isn't just going to be a smoke and mirrors magic wand moment. It is show not tell and do not speak, right? And so yeah. it's about how they can go back to the respective uh, organizations and get AI actionable and move it to the core of the enterprise. That's the real goal of the conference, and we hope uh, you know everybody listening will be there. I absolutely love that. I just want to throw out a couple of numbers because this is really impressive. You've got 25,000 customers all over the world. You have 600,000 builders on your platform and connect nearly or over 11,000 applications. More than 750 billion tasks have been automated on Workauto. That's a wild number, just to be clear. I can't even imagine. We, I, it's hard By to count way, that. By the way, 750 billion, the snap of this finger, that means there's 40,000 tasks that have been automated in this second somewhere around the world based on the scale that we just talked about. That's Just amazing like, to think about. Wow, that's so cool. Yay to all of you out there automating. That's so exciting. And 800 partners globally. You've seen a lot of growth over the last year. Very awesome moment. Why should folks sitting at home, maybe on the fence about coming, jump on the Workato rocket ship this summer? I think it's important for them. There's been a lot of talk about, like, how do I get productive and how do we bring the best version of ourselves and our companies in this AI world? And this is an opportunity for them to come here and see this in action and take this to the respective enterprises and do that, right? And that's really the opportunity for organizations. Yeah. Going from hype AI to real AI, going from experimental AI to actionable AI, and that's what this conference is about. I love it. Last question for you. 
What do you hope that folks are saying, your community is saying, as they're getting on those planes to leave Vegas after the show? What are they texting their partner or telling their colleagues about the week? What happens in Vegas doesn't stay in Vegas. So we're going to take these innovations, bring it back to the organizations, and make AI actionable in the enterprise and bring it to the core of the enterprise. Chandar, you've certainly convinced me, and I hope that you've convinced everyone in the audience. I cannot wait to hang out with your community and your partners and your builders in Las Vegas next month. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. It's going to be great. You know, as I say, you know, we're going to be there. The future of work is going to be there, and I hope everyone listening will be there, too. It'll be great. Yes, well, it's certainly going to be a party because we're going to be there. We're all going to be there. <laughs> thank you so much for taking the time today. This has been great. Thank you, Savannah. And thank all of you for tuning in. I hope we're going to see you at Workato Wow in Las Vegas the third week of August. My name is Savannah Peterson. You're watching The Cube, the leading source for enterprise tech news.